Welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Carlin Gaming Pokemon Legends Arceus Nuzlocke Challenge. Where, as you can see, I'm just having a quick pep talk with our newest of team members here. We, of course, have Talia the Chansey and Jellybean the Pure Ugly. And as you can see, we have definitely decided to go for bulk on the team. Nothing we're not accustomed to. Nice, nice, what are you doing? Stop talking to Purple Hat Man. Oh, just he scared you away. All right, as you can see, we have lots of bulk going around on the team. It's, you know, frankly, it's the, it, I think it's just the way to be. Now, obviously, uh, we have uh, Rotera here, who is not very bulky, but not yet, but will be, will be, right? Because eventually it will evolve into a Sylveon or an Umbreon. Who knows which one it could be? I don't know, I haven't, I gotta go back and look at the comments, but we will tally that number when it comes. Um, so far, you know, um, it seems like Talia, Adjusting well, happy to be here. You know, just a generally happy Pokemon all around. Jelly Bean um, seems like eager to do some fighting. You know, sort of like, uh, yeah, I'm here. I'm ready to go. Let's fight. Let's fight. Want to fight? Let's fight. Uh, you know, what I mean, you can kind of tell. Just look, look at the eyes on look on Jelly Bean. I mean, Jelly Bean wants to knock stuff out. Um, nice. What are you doing? What are you doing? Ugh, nice has been. This has been happening. But nice, we've just lost so many team members. It's just nice has been around for pretty much all of the losses, and it just it just hurts. And I, th I think the coping mechanism has indeed been sleep, uh, which is understandable. On the other hand, you know who's not sleeping? Mercury, Mercury, always vigilant, always trying to get stronger, ready to avenge all of our lost foes, ready to knock out some APOM, am I right? As is, if there, if there was ever a right hand um, weasel, it was Floatzel Luisa. Uh, these two right here, oh my gosh, what deadly, what a deadly duo these two have become. Such good friends, good training partners. Uh, not to say that Nice isn't, you know, he's also been around for quite, she's also been around for quite a while. Hold on. She has also been around, <laughs> I know, uh, has been around. Um, but just is taking the losses of our teammates so much harder. Uh, or is just coping with it differently. Not to say that these two haven't taken it hard. Anyway, we have to go get Basket Legion so we can go catch more teammates. Everyone come back. Whoop, 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 whoop. Here we go. And we're on a deer. Let's go. I want to try and get, let's get, um, who's our lowest level at the moment? It's actually a jelly bean. Well, that, we're just going to have to go ahead and get Jelly Bean some, some XP there. I think we're just heading right down here to the beach so we can go get our Basket Legion. We have to go find the dude or... Ah, oh, there he is. Hi there, Mr. Afraid of Ghosts. Would you like to give me a fish? Oh, hello, Jaha. I was just waiting for you. Mm-hmm. Yes, cool. Teach me the brand new song that no one's heard before. Brrr. Oh, man. That tiny sport guy's the tiny Growlithe. He's looking pretty sus. What do you think? Mm-hmm. All right. Like, we get it. I see. Well, in that case, let me summon Basket Legion. Oh, yeah. Summon up some Basket Legion, dude. It's the same song. They're always the same song. If this is all I had to do, it seems like I could have just come down to the water and played my flute. Don't need to know anything special for this. Ooh! Whoa, big fish! There it is, oh, all the glory. What's weird to me is that Basculin has an evolved form in the past, but not in the future. Like, what happens? Why does it stop evolving over time? You know, that seems weird, right? Right? I don't know. You threw in the ball of Basculin food. We obviously censored it because that would have been ridiculous to show you it eating something. Ugh, oh, the great Basculin. Is he gonna give me a splash plate or something? You should let Basculin hear you're playing. Okay. I'm in. Yes, I am so good at the flute, you guys. One of the best flautists out there, I dare say. I'd brag about it. All right, let's go. Let's go to Fire Spit Island. Basque Legion opened its heart and learned well the sound of your playing. <sighs> oh, and we got a splash plate. Take that, Volo. How many splash plates do you have, hmm? I suspect zero, all right? You're not off be befriending giant fish the way I am. Now you can ride Basque Legion across Tranquility Cove and head to Fire Spit Island. Grow wow! My congratulations to you, Jay. Rawr. Yeah, okay, we got it. Let's go. I'm into it. I want to ride my fish. Get out of Stop it. Stop talking to me. 
Go, 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 go. Mm-hmm. Perhaps, but nonetheless. Yep. Okay. Fantastic. We get it. We get it. Oh my gosh, people. I got things to do. Oh my gosh. We have to fight. Oh, is this a boss fight? Uh-oh. It is boss fight. Prepare for trouble and make it triple. I don't even rhyme. My goodness. I'm pretty sure one of these is it is uh, get red in hand over that growl. Oh, you want to take my partner? Look, it seems unfair to me that I am the one who has to risk my Pokemon fighting these jabronis when you guys are like the the you know leaders of your clan's regions and whatnot. Oh goodness. Oh. <laughs> Do they already get it? Oh, thanks to the Growlithe, fools! We three can't live the kind of lives we want because of narrow-minded groups like the Diamond Clan and Pearl Clan. If we want to live freely in the Great Land of Hisui, we need to have powerful Pokemon on our side. Don't worry, we'll make sure this pup grows up nice and strong. We'll even make him lord for you. Let's take the mud to our camp and get to work. No one will bother us in a place so miserably hot. All right, then. See, do I have to fight you now, or I just I should know that I need to fight that? All right, see ya. They just sort of came out of nowhere, huh? Uh, what? No, Growlithe. Uh. All right. Well, that was sad. What should we do, Shay? This is an emergency, right? Yeah, you guys are the adults here, man. I fell out of the sky, lest you forget. Stop asking this child to solve all your problems. They said they were going to a place where nobody would bother them. The only place around the Cobalt Coastlands that seems suitable is Fire Spit Island. What? Wouldn't you know? That's exactly where I'm headed. It just so happens that I've recently befriended Giant Fish. Giant Fish is going to take me there, man. It's going to be no problem. I got this. We must go now. All right. I bet you guys managed to get there regardless of, of you know, not being friends with giant fish. And that all by side questing will feel very... Yep. Okay. Yeah. Well, more time to adjust your aim. All right. Let's go. Let's surf. Woohoo! We're on a fish! We can jump and double jump! What? That's awesome. Watch this, when you when you jump, you can go whoop, everything slows down, everything slows down, so you can try and catch a Pokemon while you're up there. We are so swimming right now, y'all. But are we in a new area? That's the question. Ah, Tranquility Cove. Okay, so we are in a new area. There's Remoraide, not that exciting. There's Remoraids. Yeah, I don't know if we want the Remoraids. If we get like a Quillfish, ooh, let's see, ah, okay. The Dusclops, not Dusclops, Drift Blims and whatnots are pretty cool. Let's land up here. Oh no! We got another spirit thing. Hooray us. The other thing is there's stuff up here on these islands we can potentially catch. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What's that? Oh! Alpha Mantine! That's interesting. Probably gonna pass on the alpha. Cause it has not been going so well for us whenever we attack those guys. Mm -hmm. oh, what's over here on this island? Some shellos, okay, shellos, not bad. Water, ground, okay. We're gonna keep our options open. We're just exploring the options at the moment. We definitely need to catch something though, cause you know, we're more aid. Drift Lamb, more Mantine. There's like caves in here we can go into as well, if I'm not mistaken. Oh yeah. Lunker's Lair. All right, this is a whole new area. Oh, a Tentacool. Tentacruel, pretty good. Obviously not as good as Luisa, because Luisa's just an amazing, such an amazing water type. Always oh, just good to see our options though. Ooh, another little spirit thing. Let's go get a big tentacruel over there. Oh boy, alpha tentacruel? It's tempting, y'all. It's tempting to at least go, you know, look at or something. There are 17 wisps remaining in the area. Oh boy. Dare we? Dare we? 
I mean, we may as well, like, throw a ball at it, right? Like, what's it, what's it gonna hurt? Right? Like, what's it gonna hurt? This is the jump button? Okay. Okay, it looks like we're nice and behind it, too. Oh, it did not work, and now we're fighting it. Whoops, I did not want to do that. Tentacles filled with might. This was a mistake. What could it hurt? Oh my god, it's gonna hurt real bad. Oh no. Oh no! What was I thinking? That was a terrible mistake. Mm -hmm. Welp. You guys, I don't want to say that was the... Wow. Just the absolute worst decision we've ever made in the entirety of Nuzlocking. That was such a rogue, I did not, I just thought we were gonna hit it in the back, it was gonna break out and we'd say, okay. I super didn't expect that. Oh my gosh, Jelly Bean. Wow, wow. I was so excited to kind of have you on the team. You're a bit of a glass cannon. I'm not sure you had a long, long future on the team, but wow, I thought it would be longer than that. Um, yikes, that was really bad. This game is so hard and I hate it. And by hate it, I mean it's like been a very fun journey, but also it's been really hard because stuff like that just happens, you know? Ugh, tentacles and tentacruels over here. Oh, we gotta find some. We gotta find, we gotta get some. Every, everything on my team, I want nothing but bulk. Okay. Okay, maybe, maybe the, maybe the drift limb is a good, oh, please don't hit me. What are you doing? What are you doing to me? Oh, maybe the drift limb is not a bad idea because that's bulky. It's ghost, it's flying, it's got a lot of good typing on it. It's sounding better and better. I'm talking myself into it. Okay, we're gonna try and get it. Oh boy, that was terrible. We're just surrounded by mean water Pokemon. Where'd it go? Ugh, come on now. Come on now. Why can't you hit something? Self? All right. We're gonna have to go. Now this is tricky because we definitely don't want to die. We've got like 10 levels on this thing. Let's go. And I and like, we're gonna be super effective in a couple of ways here. So let's just try and thunder wave it, then fire fang it, right? That, yep. Okay, here we go. Paralyzed and can't move. That's right, it can't move. Now we give it a fire fang. Okay, nice. Solid, still paralyzed. Still at our mercy. We weaken it, excellent. Okay, now I think we just go for the, uh, just go for the great ball. Here we go. It's paralyzed, it's weak. Look at it. <laughs> Get it. Boy, those are not great graphics under the water, is it? We got Drift Blim! Hooray, all right, we're amazing. Yay, all right, well, it's probably coming on the team, I'm not gonna lie, but geez. Oh, we're having such a hard time. Seagrass Haven, this is a whole new area, so suddenly we can immediately catch something else. How about, hey, Weird Ear, why don't you just get your butt in motion here? This is both the water ground type, kind of weak to grass, it's no doubt, but otherwise pretty. Pretty chonk. Let's see. Let's check our map real quick. Seagrass Haven. We just got Lunker's Lair, right? Except that apparently it's not labeled on here. That's weird. Nonetheless, um, Seagrass Haven. Maybe we just go ahead and pick up and try and get the Shellos. Because they're not that hard to catch, I don't think. I'm just going to sneak up on it, right? Get it! Get in the ball, Shellos. Oh no! Oh man. We're gonna try that again real quick. Hold on. No, no, nothing to see here. Nothing to see. Nothing to see. Oh, it's shooting at us. Okay. Don't mind me. Did it run up the tree? Well, that was weird. You don't like berries? I guess not. Oh, still angry. Gosh. Okay, that was a mistake. Let's 
I want to catch the big guy right up front, man. Oh, he's, he's staring at us. It's pretty sus. Like, I don't know about that guy over there. Don't mind me. I'm just sneaking. I'm just sneaking. I think it's like jumping around like crazy. He's like, God, I, look, he's just staring at me. He's like, I don't trust you at all. I don't trust you. Well, you should trust me. I'm so about to go. Oh, but, 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 just turn it around, man. Don't worry. Nothing to see. Turn your weird zombie eyes around. Gotcha. Backstrike. Catch it. Do it. Yes! Gastronaut, sorry, not shallow. Scott, you guys have been screaming at the screen. Ah, wrong Pokemon, Jay. All right, well, there we go. Oh boy, okay, okay. All right, let's go. Uh, we're heading to Fire Spit Island now. Woo! Where there are indeed some cool Pokemon we can catch, there's no doubt. Although, honestly, we should probably go. Hold on, I should probably go. Mothums? Everyone else's least favorite. I don't know why I can't go a single episode these days without getting some sort of weird death situation going on. I don't like it. It's just, it's so much death. So much death. All right, here's what we're going to do. We need to go, obviously, do a quick, um, we got something at Seagrass Haven, so we can go ahead and just mark that. We got something over here at Lunker's Lurk, so we're just going to mark that as well, even though it's not there. We're going to visit the camp, and we're going to, Switch out the necessary Pokemon because Jelly Bean took a real unfortunate Hydro Pump to the face that I have to tell you I am really upset about. Yeah, okay. Oh, we forgot, I forgot about the Dust Clops. So, oh, that's pretty good. Okay, hold on. Jelly Bean! I'm so sorry. I had such high hopes for you. I've never used you before, and I was like, you know what? What a great opportunity. I'm gonna get to use you pure ugly. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna slash stuff up. It's gonna be good against ghost Pokemon, but and it was not to be. I'm sorry. You had a few good fights, but I let you down. I shouldn't have gone near that Tentacruel. That's my mistake. Very well, friend. Uh, all right, I think we do need... Oh, we have several Pokemon we need to nickname, don't we? We never nicknamed this feel. Oh, gosh, we have to do a bunch. We've got, like, five Pokemon to name over here. My goodness, okay. Good thing Ben is here today. Man, this is what happens when you don't have Master Namer around. You know what I'm saying? Ben Jam. Hello. I need, like, many names. I've been slacking here. I've got, like, five Pokemon to name. What? I know, it's unbelievable. It's almost ben. like you're not even... It's, it's like I'm doing a bad job at my job, I know. So first we have the Sveal. Sveal? Oh He's got a, like a beach ball. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. You know? I gotcha, I gotcha. Um, um, you know, how about Gene? Gene? Gene. Is that G with a G or with a J? G with a G-E-N-E, -E -E. Gene. Oh man, what a great name. Gene. Gene's a big All fan right. of denim. <laughs> Gene loves denims. <laughs> Can you just imagine this Pokemon wearing Jeans. <laughs> <laughs> yep. All right, now we have a, a Togepi. All right, Togepi, Togepi. All right, yep. Let's <clears throat> see here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, how about scroll back up just a little bit? Okay, so uh, I believe that the, the name of the person who commented is Dork Forge. Okay. But I like Forge. Okay. Because it sounds like a very intense name for a very unintense looking Pokemon. Forge. It's a good, that's, that's solid. I yeah. like your, I like the reasoning there. Right. All right, next we have Dusclops. Dusclops. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. This is not even funny, but just Caitlyn. <laughs> just Caitlyn. <laughs> just it's, it's, it's like the opposite of a ghost Pokemon. <laughs> like, what's the spookiest thing you could think of? Caitlyn. Caitlyn. Is this the right spelling? C-A-I-T-L-Y-N. Oh, L-Y-N. Of course. Caught my eye because I'm married to an Alice with a Y. I gotcha. Caitlin, Caitlin might be joining the team. I'm not gonna lie. We need, we need more defense. Yeah, that's probably how. I'm just gonna go ahead and move. All right, welcome, Caitlin. All right, now we have Driftblim. Driftblim. I like. Uh, there's a person here named Jonah Magnus, but I like Magnus. Magnus. Boom. And Gastrodon. Kisses. 
kisses. Just kisses. Just kisses. Just kisses. Just kisses. There it is. What a perfect name. Because it's basically a giant slug, and who doesn't want? <laughs> who doesn't want? Kisses? Who doesn't want kisses from giant slug Gastron? Okay, there we go. All right, all caught up on our naming. Super sorry about that. I'm sure you guys have been like, Jay, you have you have the name things. Uh, so we're gonna add Caitlyn to the team. Look at those glorious defensive stats there. Let's go ahead and. Uh, let's hit change moves, just see if there's anything we're missing out on Shadow Ball. We have the, what does Hex do? It is 65, 100, Shadow Ball is 80, 100. They're basically the exact same. Mm -hmm. Oh, doubled if they have a condition, but it doesn't look like we have anything that caused conditions. So we could potentially just pr switch it for Shadow Sneak for the... Speed, this use raises the speed. Okay, so that's pretty good. And then absorb, get some health back. We are, what are we stronger with is the question. Hold on, let me see. We have stronger attack rather than special attack. Okay, so that's good to know. So actually we probably do want shadow sneak then. And then is this, this is special and that's special and that's special. And so leech life, actually pretty strong. We're gonna go shadow sneak in favor of hex. Um, confirm. Yes, we are good there. So unfortunately, we don't have great um, physical moves to go with our physical attack, but we do have strong, strong defense and special defense there. So we're sticking with our very bulky lineup um, of Pokemon. And now we must uh, head over to Fire Spit Island at Long Lastington, eh? All right, we have arrived on the Fire Spit Island, which means, oh, here we go. Are we gonna have, to have a fight right here? Oh no. Ooh, Fire Spit Island is certainly hot enough to feel like a sweat bath, isn't it? That sounds disgusting, man. And now we've got to, why would you even say those words next to each other? Uh, <laughs> I'm very sorry, but do you think you could lead the way? What, how did you, how did these people arrive in leadership positions at all? Gosh, they are the worst. Mayonnaise, y'all. Mayonnaise. All right, let's get some stuff. Now, there are cool Pokemon we can catch here. And we are at least going to fight it because we want Louisa to get as much experience as possible heading into this next round where we fight the Arcanine, where we're definitely going to be relying on Louisa to just wreck its face off. Ba bam! Magmar dead. Excellent. Okay. Question is what other kinds of. Um, Pokemon shall we encounter in here? Anything particularly rare? That'd be nice. Hi there. I mean, I love Magmar, don't get me wrong. I mean, especially, oh my gosh, you guys. Maybe we should just go ahead and catch this because do you know what happens when Magmar evolves? Do you know what happens to their arms? Yeah, you all know. You all know when you evolve a Magmar, they get literal cannons for arms. Oh, look at this guy. Look at this guy, he wants to fight. You You don't look so, you don't look nice. Ugh, ugh, what a pathetic Graveler. What an absolute waste of a Graveler. Mm-hmm, get out of here, you're dead. We're just making short work of everyone. Luisa very close to leveling up now. Come on, get over here. You wanna fight, you wanna get all angry about it? Oh, uh-oh. Oh man, I thought those Magmars were about to join in on the fight and just were about to swarm us like three on one. I was going to be really upset. Alas, we have killed the Graveler. Wonderful, wonderful. Very good, very good. <gasps> you guys seeing this? You guys seeing this? Yeah, do it, Talia. Do it! Oh my gosh, I wasn't expecting this to be so close to evolution. Well, 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 well. We're going to have a Blissey just like that? You think Chansey has got some HP? Look at this thing. Big egg! Big egg, Talia! Oh my gosh, how exciting! What the what? Let's see, change moves. Did we learn anything? Not in particular, but that's okay. Are we, and we're still just normal type. We've got, okay, so still normal type though. That's good because we're about to go fight Gengar. And Gengar has lots of ghost type moves. Hopefully, it doesn't have like. Focus blast or something that would it feels like it would Doesn't it um, what else or what else are we gonna have that's gonna be good against the Gengar? probably uh, Mercury because we have crunch right we have crunch there um, Nothing there 
Nothing there. We have Draining Kiss, which is good because it lower because it gives us health back. And also we have Soft Boiled here. And also we can increase our defense. So that's good. That's our main, we can Calm Mind, we can Draining Kiss. We won't be able to hit it with Double Edge, but we can Soft Boil it ourselves. Now, this one's tricky because obviously we have like Ghost Moves, but Ghost is weak to Ghost, so there's that. We do have like Dark Pulse, but they're gonna be, um, yeah, I think, I think if we're gonna fight the, the whatever team, we wanna lead with Mercury just so we can crunch them. But we also, I don't know, maybe it's better, maybe it's better to just, attack with Talia and just try and sponge damage. I just don't know if they have like Focus Blast or not. That's sort of the, the problem. But I still wanna give Luisa, oh man, I wanna, I wanna catch one of these Magmars. Oh, okay, not this one, this one wants to fight me. It's going down, sorry. Sorry, not sorry, Magmar. You're going down. Water Pulse. Boom, all right, it's dead. But we're gonna catch the next one. Or we're gonna try to, anyway. Grit dust. Okay, all right, can we... Can we distract it with a berry? Go eat a food. Oh, it's, oh, it's into it. It's into that food, y'all. Can we catch the magmar? Oh, we got it! Yes, magmar is caught! That was great. All right, we'll need a name for that later. If you'll remember, our last Magmortar. Ice! Made it all the way through the game. All the way through the game. Completely amazing in every way. Ice, ice, baby. I don't know where I can pick that up. <coughs> oh boy, I feel like we're very close to a fight. Yeah, like we're very close. Well, yeah, there they are. There's the the Bad Luck Sisters and the Gengar, and we're gonna have to go fight it. The question is, should we lead with Talia? Should we lead with Mercury? I mean, they're both both wonderful choices. I'm like, I just don't know what the Gengar has. Like, it, it wouldn't surprise me if it randomly had like Earthquake, and it wouldn't surprise me if it randomly had like Focus Blast, which would just re well, it would be bad. It could be bad either way. I feel like Mercury is the solid choice. It's the better attacker. And it's who we're gonna it's who we're gonna go with. Oh gosh, please don't be the wrong choice. Please don't be the wrong choice. Please don't be the wrong choice. Let's go fight these ladies. Oh gosh. Are we gonna have to have multiple fights though? Molten Arena! Here we go. Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous. <sighs> Come on, evolve already! We've done our homework. Any Pokemon gutsy enough to come to this lava trap is supposed to evolve. So get on with it already. You will become stronger, like it or not. Enter me. Hey guys, love your volcano. Not great for my shoes or probably your sandals. They're made of wicker. All right, do we have to fight everyone now? We have six Pokemon. Bandit Clover, what do you got? What do you got? Oh, she has the Obama Snow. Adorable, adorable. Okay, we're gonna go Mercury. Why she chose to go with a uh, Grass Ice Pokemon here in uh, the Volcano area is beyond me. But we are gonna go straight up Fire Thing on this thing and totally ruin its day, right? This should be more than enough to destroy it one shot. Boom, Mercury with the Fire Thing! Oh, Mercury's so good. Battle decided. <laughs> I guess she is like the ice gym leader later on, right? Like her, her descendant is. Eh, hey, there you go. Oh, Rotera, still not ready to evolve. Not yet. You know, a bomb still can't fight at full power, crazy heat like this. That's exactly what I said. <laughs> He's like, why did I do that? Go on then, Toxicroak. Oh, Toxicroak, eh? Well, if only we apparently had an APOM, this would be a really easy fight. Now, we don't have, like, any Psychic-type attackers at the moment, so this could be a little bit tricky. Um, we definitely don't want Talia for this. Although, you know what? It does occur to me that maybe Caitlyn would be good here, because can't be hit by Fighting-type moves. But I also... Man, I don't want... Should I switch to Caitlyn? 
might be good. Yeah. Definitely not. I mean, it's not that Mercury can't do a good job here. She's like, this thing, it's like fighting poison. So I think we're pretty solid. Like, I mean, if we fight, we don't have anything that's like super effective against it. Like Crunch isn't great. Thunderfang probably does a lot. Thunder Wave, probably not a bad thing to throw on it just for, let's Thunder Wave it and just see how we go from there. Paralyzed, okay. Mud Bomb, okay, yes, yeah, I don't like that. Yeah, that's bad. Became obscured. Okay, we're gonna switch to Caitlyn, yeah. We don't want to be hit with Mud Bomb. See, this is the thing, you never know what they're gonna have. They all have such crazy move variety. Mud Bomb again. See, we took that pretty good. We are, maybe we could, uh, no, that's not very effective, is it? Let's go Shadow Sneak, see how this does. Because we get to go again, so we can just see how much damage we do. Not a lot. Shadow Ball, more damage, but I don't think it's gonna hurt. I don't think it's gonna be able to kill us, is the thing. God, I'm gonna be so mad if they kill Caitlyn. I wish Leaf's Life was gonna do better, but it won't. Let's see how much the Shadow Ball does. It's still paralyzed, so it might just stay paralyzed, right? It's obscured, oh, come on. Okay, it's paralyzed, so there is that. We, I feel like we... Man, even going... I'm surprised that that's not, doesn't give us another move. Let's go for the Shadow Ball, though. It's still obscured, still. Oh my gosh. Obscured. I don't like this at all. It's very annoying that he's just like remaining. We're gonna heal some here. Yeah. Paralyzed, that's right. Cured of paralysis. Well, I don't like that. I think we need to do Shadow Sneak again. Get some damage on it, if we can ever hit it. Man, the accuracy problem is really... <gasps> okay, it's going Agile style. Okay, Blood Bomb. Should be less damage overall. Boy, the... Oh, it gets to go again, though. <gasps> oh, well, this is bad. Well, we definitely have to heal again. This is 60 HP up to a third of its max. So that would be like 30 something. So not actually enough, not as much. Up to half its max, so that would be about less than 60 as well. So this is still just the best thing to do. Oh man, if we could hit it without the mud bomb problem, it keeps, ah, oh, because it's just being obscured. Like, we're just gonna have to keep doing this. Maybe it'll just run out of mud bombs. I don't know. But we can't hit it. <clears throat> oh, there we go. Oh, I did like nothing. Oh, look, yeah, how's that feel? We avoided the attack. Like, <sighs> oh no, we don't want to go, we don't want to do that. Looks like we need to go Shadow Sneaker. It's gonna get two attacks in a row. We don't, definitely don't want that to happen. So let's go here. Oh, we're so close. Okay. But see, it's obscured. Gosh, this is so annoying. Okay, we have to heal. We have to heal. Oh, uh, you know what? Honestly, Talia, well, no, Talia would be not so agile style, okay. Talia would not be so good here because, oh gosh, I can't. Oh no! 
No, it got the crit. Oh no, oh no, that's no good. Because now it could be hit by fighting types. Oh, this is so bad. I can't, it's because they can't, it keeps using the, act. oh, we are just, this game is so hard, you guys. It's so hard. You just lose a coin flip and that's it. Let's just go. Just, just, just knock it out. Oh, but we're not gonna. Okay, they don't have, a, you don't have abilities in this game though, right? So this doesn't, it's not gonna have like dry skin where it gets, where you're like gonna accidentally heal it, right? Water pulse, let's just, just knock it out. <sighs> okay, well we got it, jeez. Caitlin. Mud bomb. Guess you lose the coin toss sometimes. <laughs> I need a score to settle. Oh boy, here we go. Now we have to, oh, they have two Pokemon this time. <clears throat> they have a Rhydon. Okay, I don't like that. That's scary. It's definitely gonna switch out of this because they're gonna have something very strong. Right, so we definitely need to switch. Yeah, because like if they'd been able to attack right there, that would have been such a non-fairness. Yeah, we're definitely gonna switch to Lisa right here. And now, oh, we got to switch and attack. Good for us. This should honestly just knock it out. Yeah, okay, so that's good. That actually worked out in our favor, but here comes the Gengar, obviously, and that's gonna be the real problem. We'll see what it has. Venoshock, so that's poison type. Wow, that did a lot of damage. Um, I kind of feel like we should switch to Talia here. Let's do it. Because this should be a good matchup. It should be, right? Like we have high special defense. Hypnosis, ugh, it's so annoying. How dare you? Okay, we are going to, but see we have soft boiled. That obviously won't work at all. We can just drain and kiss this thing, I guess. We're gonna try for a drain and kiss. Too drowsy to move. Got no shock. It should just not do that much damage though, right? Like, are you kidding me? And obviously that was a crit as well, so there is that. Um, God, look, look at that though. Got no shock. We're just gonna soft boil right away. Too drowsy to move, come on. You are kidding me with this. Please, please, no! No, are you kidding? Are you kidding? This is just, I don't know what to do. Like, I can't, I can't even fight that. Oh! What a disgrace indeed. Oh my gosh. I can't, it's like everything I bring onto the team just dies. This is so bad. How could I, like I have never, this is like the death rate is so bad, you guys. It's so hard. And it's like, I'm not, I don't even feel like I'm making, like <laughs> we threw out a normal type to fight Gengar that had 400 HP. We got hypnosis and then critical hit and then double hit. Like what, what, I, what, I, I don't. <laughs> Just insanity. <sighs> okay, yeah, I do not care about you guys' plot line with the Growlithe. I just absolutely do not. Roar. Oh, what's that sound? What? Is it Growlithe's father? But wow! It is. <gasps> uh oh. Uh oh. It's evolving!
Ba boom! Yeah, big Arcanine. Looks like he finally found his courage. The late Lord's child, he's evolved. His true bravery lay not in crossing the sea, but in finding the strength to face hardship head on. Wow. The real bravery was the friends we made along the way. You gotta be joking me. Huh? Something's not right, sisters. Uh-oh. 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 About to get zapped with some lightning. Oh yeah, frenzied noble, y'all. Bam. Oh, it does look very cool. What? Polina, stay back. All right, we got it. You evolved. What's happened to him? A strange lightning hit him. He's become frenzied, just like the other nobles. <clears throat> Seems like maybe you guys should run. Mm -hmm. All right, see ya. Bye bye now. Bye bye. Bye bye. We should get out of here too, Polina. Otherwise, we're fair game for Arcanine. Come on, Jay. We should hurry. Lena! What are you gonna do about Growlithe? I mean, Arcanine. Oh my gosh, you guys. We're, gonna, we're just gonna throw bags of balm at him, right? That's what we do. What, we, what must we do to quell his frenzy? Please, tell us what we need. What you need? Balms! What are you talking about? That is That does feel like the right reaction, doesn't it? I was so excited to get the chancy. Like, that's so annoying. Like that, they were hitting us with special, special attacks, and we have such high special defense and such like. There's just like they were ten levels lower. What are we supposed to do? Like, I don't, I don't feel like that was the wrong. Venom shock does more damage when you're poisoned, and we were not poisoned. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I don't think I have it in me to go fight the noble Pokemon right now after that devastating freaking fight. Oh my gosh, so annoying. Uh, we barely, I mean, I barely even get to know these Pokemon. Talia evolved and then probably died. Didn't get to attack once. Ugh. Caitlyn, I'm sorry. We tried. I thought the Shadow Snakes were going to work out. We did not. The, the, the mud obscured us. I mean, they were using cheap dirt, literal dirty tactics. <sighs> Our champions up here, they're still crushing it. Mercury, Louisa, nice. You guys are carrying the team. Rotera, I know you I know you're paying attention. You're learning from the best. Look at these three. They've been through a lot together at this point. Oh my gosh. Leave your condolences for Talia and Caitlin in the towel section down below. I can't believe how many Pokemon have died in this playthrough so far. It is out. Rages. Oh, a space time distortion appeared. Great. Cool, 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 cool. All right. All right. I don't know if we're going to make it to the end, guys. This is so hard. They keep... Oh, <sighs> uh, yeah, look, look. Lil J is not concerned. They're just like, yeah, we got it. No big deal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Everything's fine. Don't you worry. We got it. All right? Okay. Hopefully we do. Thanks so much for watching. Leave a like on the video if you haven't already. Subscribe if you haven't already. And don't forget to leave a comment so uh, Master Namer might choose your name for the name of one of our future, uh, apparently soon to die Pokemon. <sighs> this, is hard. this game is hard. I'll see you next time. Bye. And before we go, just want to give a huge shout out and thank you to all of our amazing patrons over on Patreon. Abby Mondin, Afropunk, Aiden Rudineras, Brianna Bouchard, Bryant, Dakota Valentine, Eduardo Bravo, Emerald Phoenix, Gamer Zylia, Gregory Lee, Jade Culture, James Buzanel, Karen Choi, Kimberly Lee, Lauren Alexandra, Luxpa92, Rashaba, Robbie Cruz, Stacy, and 0412. Again, thank you all so much for your continued support over on Patreon. If you'd like to see your name on this wall, you can head over to patreon.com slash supercarlingaming. We also have some other really awesome tiers like our quarterly merch tier and one option to sit down and play some games with me and Ben once a month. If any of that sounds interesting to you, go check it out.
dead spork. <laughs>